What's going on, Infinite Fam? Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell, leave a positive comment down below for a chance to get out. Wow. For a chance to get a shout out in the next video. That's right, guys. So today marks day one of our road trip journey. We are finally going to Florida to our new home. Uh, we're currently still in Jersey. We've only been on the road for probably a good maybe like half hour to like 40 minutes. And we got about another 16 hours to go. That is freaking insane. Guys, I've done this road trip before and it wasn't pleasant, but at that time I was with my family and they had a car seat in the car. So I don't know, this time it's different because it we is have different. Nanny. And because you're in an M3. Yeah, we're in this beautiful car, That's so it right. makes say, everything say better. Say one more time. Say one more time for the plants in the back. What? <laughs> say one more time for the plants in the back. Show them the back seat, yo. Show them how packed it is. Guys, our back seat is completely packed up and ready to go. And then we already have everything in Isaiah's grandfather's truck, which is in front of us. So it's gonna be it's gonna be an interesting drive. We're gonna stop a couple times, obviously, for like gas and to like use the bathroom and stuff. I'm hoping I can find a Bojangles when we get to like North Carolina, South Carolina. I want Janice to try it. I'm like I've been gassing it the whole time. Like speaking of the move and everything. Thing. To me, it's like a better version of Popeyes. But yeah, if you guys ever had Bojangles, let me know how you guys think of it down below. guys so right now we just hit the worst thing possible on the road trip and that is traffic we are currently in virginia pretty dang close to richmond so i think that's halfway through virginia almost uh, correct me if i'm wrong um you want to tell them that when we had our first stop we had our first stop maybe about like an hour ago you want to tell them what you ate and it was like 10 o'clock in the morning dipping dots ice cream and I don't care. She had some ice cream and a chicken wrap. Yeah, that is a I, it nasty was really mix. nasty. The chicken wrap was actually really nasty, but honestly, and you still ate it. I still ate it because I didn't eat anything. That's so what I'm I wasn't about. just gonna eat like. That's what I'm talking about. I was just gonna eat ice cream for breakfast, so I figured if I have something that's really disgusting and I hate it, I might as well have something that I'm gonna enjoy too. I can't even talk honestly because I had a cookie and Mountain Dew. Right, he over here talking about me. You over here eating freaking snacks, nighttime snacks for nighttime breakfast. Nighttime snacks, all right, you know what, whatever, bro. <laughs> um, honestly, at this point, I'm just still on the lookout for a Bojangles. If I see it, best believe I'm taking the exit because you need Bojangles in your life other than mine. Oh man, that's gonna probably be a whole separate video did you of not us just like catch trying that? it for the first time, huh? Did you not catch that? No, what did you say? nothing maybe they caught it but um yeah guys go ahead say what you want to say and then close it out <laughs> no that's all i'm saying but guys this trip for me has been so far a little stressful only because for the first couple of hours blooper did not want to calm down like he is jumping all over the place he's crawling on me like there's so much hair all over the freaking seats he's finally calmed down i feel like a mom mom like if he's not sleeping then i'm not sleeping i can make you a mom so. all right we'll catch you guys when we're at our next stop So we finally found. Guys, I'm so happy. Yo, we got pump fake the first time. Yo, tell them about that. Guys, so we found a Bojangles, but for the second time. The first time, we saw the sign for it, but we might have just missed it. And it's okay because nah, man, I looked it up. That's false advertisement. We didn't miss it. <laughs> I looked it up and it only had two stars. So maybe whoa, that's a good idea. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You be the judge, all right? Don't be going off the internet. And it, the internet's lying, okay? So. I don't want to hear nothing about two stars out of five. Screw that. All right. It's going to be five. All right. You're going to like it. We shall see. So uh, he is gassing this up quite a lot. You're going to like it. We'll see. So you guys are going to see if I really like Bojangles or not. Finally found it. It was right off the exit. You ready? I guess. I'm telling you, it's going to be fire. Look at my grandfather. Uh, he already got the chicken. He got the drinks. Look, I'm telling you, it's going to be a good time. It's gonna be a good time. All right, let's go, come on. Oh 
She got her little Bojangles box. All right, what you want to tell me what you got? <laughs> I got chicken tenders and fries with honey mustard. That's right, but it's from Bojangles. Oh my god. This is the best thing, and you got a sweet tea too. You got the Bojangles sweet tea. I did. Hold on, I gotta open this. Honey mustard? Have some class. Shut up. Have some class. All right, all right take that ready? first. Yes, I'm ready. Are first you impressions: ready? the tenders are small. All right, all right. It's not always about size, if you know what I mean. Oh my gosh. All right, you ready? Go. Yeah, let's see it. Let's see. So, so, come They're on. Good. They're good. All right, what would you rate it as far as tenders? Five. All right, let's um, go. It's good. <laughs> it's good. So, would you say that, you know, my uh, review or my recommendation, I should say, is up to par? Hold on. Oh, she needs another fry. Another fry. Hold on. Okay, chew, chew, chew. Yeah, it's Swallow. Good. Uh, relax. <laughs> Jesus, can I eat? All right, okay. sip of the sweet tea. Here we go, here we go. Good. Okay. Second. Second sip. Sweet tea's not that sweet, honestly. Okay, is it better or worse than Popeye's? Sweet tea. Mm, Popeye's got it. All right, you know what? I don't even want to do this clip anymore. <laughs> All right, guys, so fast forward about maybe half hour, 40 minutes after we just ate. Oddly enough, Janice's favorite part about the Bojangles meal was the biscuit. And of yeah. course, I didn't get it on camera. Of course. I like the biscuit only because personally, I don't eat bread a lot. But since we don't have any options, I'm hungry and I ate it. And it was fire. The only thing is, I wish that I could have had some honey and butter. That would have been amazing. I want you to rate the Bojangles meal you had one out of 10. I give it... 10 being that was the best fast food chicken spot you ever had. Let's see, I would give it a seven. Wow, are you serious, bro? Yeah. What is the best fast food chicken spot you had? Um, Crispy Crunchy Chicken. Come on, bro. No, it's Cut not. Cut it out. Yes, it is. No, bro. Yes, it it is. doesn't compare. Bro. And they got the best biscuits because there's their biscuit comes honey glazed. Bro, that biscuit you had was sweet. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. It was a little sweet and salty. No, no, it wasn't. All right, bro. Whatever. All right. And then she's trying to argue with me saying that the sweet tea is not better than Popeye's. Bro, sweet tea from Popeye's it always comes like semi-warm. This sweet Who tea cares? is so much better and cold. Oh my goodness, it's the flavor. And they're not sponsoring me, guys. I'm not getting paid to talk good about Bojangles. I just strongly feel about this right now, all right? I think Isaiah's just mad because I don't love Bojangles as much as he does. You know it was good. It was good. I'm not saying it's not. I'm saying that I've had better. I think I'm going to get Bojangles tatted on my neck. Go ahead and do that. And watch how much I'm going to make fun of you. So we're going to continue driving. We should be hitting North Carolina within the next hour or so. After that, we're going to drive straight through. And at the border, when we hit South Carolina, I think that's when we're going to take it in for the night. And then we'll go ahead with part two of our road trip journey tomorrow morning. So uh, we'll see you guys when we get to South Carolina. Alright guys, so we finally made it to our motel, hotel, I'm not sure what it is, but honestly, it's not the nicest and I'm a little worried about being here, I'm not going to lie to you guys, it's not the cleanest place, but we're literally in the middle of nowhere in South Carolina and this was the best place that we could find according to reviews. Um, the reviews online, they lied. 100%. Literally 100% lied. Yeah, I, I don't even want to show you guys the room because it's just, it's just bad. It really <laughs> is. Like it, It's not like dirty or anything, it's just... I don't know, you get you ever get that feeling where you're just like, mm, I'm, I don't really like this, this doesn't really feel like the best, I don't know, I feel it uneasy. It literally looks like the base motel. It does look like the base motel, it's, it's just weird, I don't know guys, but we're going to close it out here. This is part one of our road trip journey to our new home. We're going to catch you guys in the next video where we'll be doing part two, which will be starting tomorrow morning when we pick up the camera again. So thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up if you guys are ready to see part two. And with all that being said, is there anything you want to say? No, I'm just ready to get up on out of here and start the day tomorrow. Same, same. So we'll see you guys in the next video.